Hello YouTube and welcome to a short tax loss video. I've got here one of those famous Samsung Galaxy Note 7 devices. It's even the Blue Corel version. And I had this phone for about for over four weeks. It was one of the last devices Samsung had shipped before ordering the stop. And now they are recalling all devices, they are giving you a refund. And I did not make any videos with this device because uh, if I do YouTube videos, I don't want to be the person to blame if people say, hey, tax laws used it, so I used it too, and now my house burned down or anything like that. So I did not do any videos. So now I'm returning it to Samsung, but still, at least I want to have a look at it. So on the back side, we got Samsung Galaxy Note 7, uh, all the stuff and no, this is not really, really, really the, the important point right now. This Note 7 is is disappearing from the market. So just have a quick look around and then put it back into the box and send it back to Samsung. I'm really, really sorry for them. So nothing here, nothing here. So we got our seal, check if not broken and wrap it all the way up. And there we go. So let's see. Ooh. Shiny blue, shiny, shiny blue. It would have been such a nice device. Well, let's see. Ooh, and the back side. This is ah, it, it would have been such a nice device for, for 2016. Maybe the best device in 2016, maybe even better than the Apple iPhone 7 Plus. And you know, one thing, even even the smart pen or the S pen as Samsung is calling it is the same blue color. And this is just something I really looked forward to testing and reviewing the blue version. But now, oh, and one thing I heard is that the, the frame, the golden aluminum frame or, or surrounding the device would be too bright or too golden. And no, it's a little bit like copper, but it's definitely nothing fancy or nothing gold, shiny, shiny, bling, bling, anything like that. No, it's just, it feels really nice and I really like holding the Note 7. I definitely like holding the Note 7 better than the Samsung Galaxy S7 Edge. I was not comfortable with the Edge, so I used the normal S7. And here I would definitely would have switched to the Note 7 because of the bigger screen. And I mean, this is such a small device. Oh, let me see, where did I put? Oh, over there. Ooh. There we go. There's my black iPhone 7, which is smaller, or we got the smaller screen, but is even wider than the Note 7. And this is something, hmm, this would have been such a nice comparison video here. So what else is in the box? Let's quick check it out. We got our SIM card tool here and a micro SD card tool. We got some papers in. Let's see where are the papers, the papers are on top. We got a quick start, start guide, warranty guide and all the stuff. No stickers at all. And then we got a white charger for a blue device. No problem. Here we got an output of, what's that? 9 volt, 1.87 or 5 volt. So we got a 10 watt charger, normal USB port. Uh, we got a USB to go adapter. We got even a use micro USB to USB type C adapter here. And we got our headphones and no use type, you know. <laughs> Oh, my device got not a micro uh, USB Type-C cable. Hmm, hmm, strange. But at least we got white headphones. So, I really have to say, hmm, sorry Samsung. I'm really sorry for, for not being able to test and check out now the Note 7, but that's it. So, this is it guys. Thank you for watching and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye.